what's up you guys so today i'm back with another video and here i'm reviewing the resurrection remix final nougat build for asus zenfone 2 laser 5.5 and uh, as you guys know if you are a little bit into the custom roms and the android development stuff so you would be knowing the name of the resurrection remix by now and it's the king of all custom roms uh, after lineage os it is the most popular uh, third party firmware for all of the android devices out there and uh, it pretty much supports most of the uh, smartphones uh, which are popular in the markets so let's begin so uh, without any delay just dig into the features and for saying this rom just covers everything up like there is no other custom out there with so many features you can almost customize everything of your android device and uh, that's feel really good with a decent amount of battery life also so let's go to the settings and all of the configurations customizations and uh, tweakings are uh, are settling the one tab in configurations here and here the, all of the features are are beautifully packed in some sections so in the status bar section here you can customize the clock position left or right like you, as you can see so the second AM PM style date date style date position date format obviously the font of the clock and the font size also and there is the brand logo which is the resurrection image logo in this status bar and custom logos also you can add that so that option is available and uh, that's good <laughs> you can also customize the battery uh, percentage battery icon and all that battery kind of stuff uh, that are common and system icons you can also customize all that so that's also available and notification ticker which is the old kitkat and jelly bean style notification pop up and uh, there's the weather temperature in the status bar you can also remove that and customize that and network traffic that also available and carrier label and status bar gestures like brightness control and double tap to sleep uh, you can also customize that and system UI tuner that's hidden in the configuration step here and from here you can do a little bit tweaking of your android device so that's also available with integrations i don't really like that so that's personal information and uh, notification drawer you can also customize these uh, the notification header if you want to change that uh, image like that um, multi user switch and uh, edit icon settings are shortcut you can also enable and disable those and task manager there is a this feature is very cute and uh, works as a task manager as the samsung devices provides and power dialog and uh, notifications you can also customize that so i'm getting a little, little quick as this ROM provides tons of customizations you can cover up all of that uh, so if you need to see those carefully then pause the video and check it up then comes the recent step uh, this is general UI you can also customize the clock clock icon show date and memory bar also the clear all button you can also click with that and obviously the recent stab and clear all button style you can also customize that and this this rom uh, provides two types of uh, recent menu as the AOS, aosp one and the grid one is the stock one and the another two there is omni switch and slim recent which are taken from the omni rom and uh, slim rom accordingly so these are very cute there goes the animation style, you can also customize with uh, the system animations, scrolling modifiers, ghost animations, power menu, everything is available here. 
there was the interface here you can pick it with your system UI and uh, that stuff obviously platform size, display size display size is the uh, uh, pixel density of your device so careful with doing that and uh, custom LED density uh, blur personalization here you can adjust blur resistance background and uh, handle the transparency of the pixel settings and etc etc uh, and the expanded desktop is also available here here you can pick your uh, headset gestures and uh, call menu customization and dashboard means the settings and configuration style of this uh, particular configuration tab and uh, settings menu and the input options and heads up uh, screenshot options everything is almost everything is available here so get to the buttons and here you can uh, <coughs> enable or disable the uh, navigation bar and uh, yeah that's uh, all about navigation and here you can customize the hardware key action like back button home button and everything menu and all of that is available and here you can customize your power menu uh, ex extend or uh, change the uh, power menu option and advanced restart is also available for, and every other um, interface customization is also available and uh, quick settings quick settings here you can uh, fix any animation like tap on the tile and they rotate or spin around that are the animations are there and uh, quick pull down tile uh, layout advanced here you can get vibrate on touch easy uh, tile and QS tiles everything is all packed in there so that's good gestures uh, is gesture anywhere like uh, you can slide from the right and get uh, your customizable uh, gesture out there and app circle bar pie control pie control is uh, from the you know, paranoid android uh, feature that lets you do some quite good work so that's also good three finger gesture if you swipe down three fingers and you get the uh, screenshot like this and that's also really good and lock screen you can also click your uh, lock screen like uh, gestures lock screen ui color customizations and blocks upper lock screen shortcuts upper shortcuts and uh, narrow shortcuts and weather options you can also enable the weather of the uh, lock screen and which uses the Omni Jaws application uh, nowadays. And lock screen security, you can also customize that. In the miscellaneous section, that uh, every device, uh, the developer adds some few tweaks like here. So, weight lock blocker saves a lot of battery, and alarm blocker, suspend action, snap remover, clock and widget settings. And you can also use that. So, that's really good. And the about section, there is the uh, developer's name and the ROM change log you can also see that so I just cover up the features settings of this tab so that's really cool and this ROM provides a decent amount of battery life also so that's why the ROM is so popular here you can see with 62 percentage of uh, battery usage uh, I'm still about to have 16 hours of battery life that's really cool and screen on time it's almost yeah, gave me <coughs> six hours of screen on time in the at the end of the day so that's enough for your device and also i hope uh, for all, the, all of the other devices the battery life should be decent amount so that was all for this review and the ROM is very smooth and the performance is very good uh, and also the battery life so if you are searching for a ROM uh, that you can also fully customize as your likings and uh, that is very smooth and also has a good amount of battery life, just go for this. And this ROM is also available for uh, most of the device out there. So I will be giving the links down below in the description. So do check out after watching this video. And it comes with the. And one thing I really forgot to tell that it comes with the. Uh, magic manager uh, inbuilt so you don't need to uh, worry about the root management and so 
that's all uh, thanks for watching and if you appreciate my work then uh, take one second and hit that red subscribe button uh, or smash it if you want to do so so thanks for watching i'll see you next time good luck bye bye